just because no one in your family does not have diabetes it does not mean that you will not get diabetes in the current era because of various dietary factors aspects of lack of exercise there are definitely greater risks for individuals who have not got a family history of getting diabetes getting type 2 diabetes which is of course the commonest form of diabetes if you do eat more sweets it's going to be containing more carbohydrates and the amount of carbohydrates is extremely dense and therefore it may lead to lack of control of your sugars in addition you might put on weight so therefore taking less sweets is a good practice having said that being a normal human being you may want to socialize once in a way and therefore having a diet holiday maybe one day in a month when you have well controlled type 2 diabetes you could take sweets on that particular day sugar intake can lead to an increase in weight this in turn could lead to insulin resistance and can lead to the presence of type 2 diabetes so indirectly eating a lot of sugar definitely can increase the risk of developing type 2 diabetes now once you have mild type 2 diabetes and you do take increased carbohydrates which also includes sugar the risk of worsening your diabetes control is certainly there there's a definite reason for it it could be because you have reached the maximum doses of tablets which may be three different or four different types of tablets plus you are following a proper diet and exercise and you've had diabetes for a number of years so if you know for your own mind that you have been disciplined with what you're doing you certainly do require insulin in this situation and you should not avoid taking it because lack of control beyond a certain point can lead to the multiple complications which might worsen issues in terms of the eye the kidney and the nerves therefore insulin requirement in type 2 diabetes is started when we don't have any other treatment options in terms of tablets on the other hand there are certain other forms of diabetes and the commonest being type 1 diabetes particularly in young people wherein the pancreas is not producing any significant quantum of insulin in this situation it is a must for you to take insulin maybe take insulin with greater frequency even four times a day monitor your sugars more frequently because your body does not have enough insulin in it and requires insulin right from the start of the disease if you have early diabetes and which is perpetuated by an increase in weight lack of exercise and you have started on tablets in a small dose by your physician now if you start doing a lot of exercise in the early phase and lose a lot of weight you could reverse diabetes by and large this is not true once you're receiving multiple medications and your physical activity and diet are reasonably good so you need to be very careful in withdrawing medications do not do it without supervision it is generally only in the early phases of type 2 diabetes that a small proportion of people may be able to withdraw their medications but this should be done with the supervision of your physician